All right, guys. So the episode was pretty hype. I'm not in my house right now. It's my brother's graduation party. So I'm actually right now in the laundry room because everyone's everywhere. There's like over 100 people invited. So I had over 200 people invited. So it went crazy. All right, so episode was good. It was actually pretty decent, but it the, the episode was overshadowed by what we wanted to see, which is the future Trunks things. Right, so you guys need to see the episode for yourselves um, to see the fight. The fight was was good. It wasn't bad. It could have been better. But the thing that surprised everyone was Copy Vegeta went Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan God Blue. That that was that was weird. I was like, what the? And it was like a different shade of blue. So that was pretty weird as well. But um, that was good. That that was interesting, right? Um, the filler was <laughs> was it was a good filler. It wasn't that bad. It had its entertaining moments, and the way it ended was good as well. It was uh, like, what the heck? It was when I was like, what the heck, man? But um, episode was good. The ending, though. Okay, well, first, um, they went fighting. I, I, it's really hard to explain because everything got overshadowed, even in my mind, by the ending and the next episode preview. But, um, yeah, if you hear noises, because people were literally everywhere. Um, what happened was... Vegeta was disappearing, he ended up putting one of the sucker, the, the thing that the guy had in his mouth to kind of like keep himself from disappearing as long as he had it in his mouth. But Trunks got in trouble, so I mean this is just a little part. I, I need you guys to see the episode because you guys need to you guys need to get that hype, right? For for from the end of the episode. But um he's wearing that, he ends up trying to save Trunks and Monaco wakes up from his like deep sleep and he steps on the actual crystal shard thing and Monaka saves the day, <laughs> but uh, it was funny because Vegeta was like on both sides. He was telling copy Vegeta like what the hell? How can you be so weak? Then he was telling Goku. How can you be so weak Goku? You know Kakarot why, why aren't you beating him? But he was arguing with both so it, it made no sense that Goku was like what side are you on? It was, it was funny. It was, it was hilarious and um, so Vegeta was fighting in between both um, He was disappearing. He ended up actually about to disappear but Monaka saved the day, so that was pretty interesting, pretty funny. Um, the, the actual gel substance didn't want to uh, take Jocko's power because Jocko was so weak, so that was funny as well. But guys, the ending, the ending was Future Trunks running. He had blue hair, red scarf. He was running and um, he kind of like looked back like with a glare, like, and the episode ended. Guys, episode was hype. We were all waiting for it. It was so sad that it was for it was um sh overshadowed by uh, the future trunks things. But it's okay. It's building up to the hype. Filler's over. It ended very very good in my opinion it, it, in a funny way. So I liked it. I enjoyed it. It was funny. Now let's get into future trunks art, guys. Hope you guys are amazing. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe for more Dragon Ball content. And uh, share the video so everyone else can find out exactly what happened. But make sure to watch the episode, guys. Make sure to watch the episode. Get that hype up. Hope you guys have an amazing day. Make sure to check out my next video on the preview. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace. I'm sorry. I I'm literally at a party, guys. It it's what I I'm doing as much as I can right now. I got you guys.